So in case nobody tell you, I think I tell you, say the oh you go where you they sleep for TV. It's different from the you go where they just live life. <laughs> hey. The people where you understand what they talk understand. The one way you they see for TV is different from real life. I said, people, the only way to date or to marry, better be careful. Because now, you just they won't build yourself for problem. Nobody lie reach them. Nobody manipulate reach them. If they fudge for your head, they will choose them over you. No guy who go, who go believe what you they talk. As you won't marry them, join. Ready to marry their people. follow. Mm -hmm. I'm ready, oh, because it's not easy. I wish you should plenty, but I don't go to talk and because when I talk and now they go talk say this one they discriminate. My brother and my sister. Whether I'm a man or a woman. Pray make you not jump the bad one. But just make I tell you, say, the one where you they see for TV is different. That's where they show you say, oh now like this, they mean like that they be they be easy going people, they're simple, they be this. <laughs> mm. Okay. Oh. No talk I no tell you. Fantastic. <laughs> This my oba Muganda Womuwala. My dada just called Muzungu Obroni called them Unguruwe. Just called Muzungu Alede. Just called Muzungu Preko. She basically just said Obroni. They are dirty like pigs. There is God. Oh. You know me. I don't like generalization. Because I believe when you generalize, you tell general lies. I agree with her in some things. In some things, I don't agree. Why? Because I believe Unguruwerism is individual based. I'm saying this because I have two white friends. They are very, they are clean freaks. So we can't say that all Obroni, they are Ungurube, they are dirty. Hmm? We cannot say that because that will be generalizing. And when you generalize, you tell general lies. <laughs> but I will, however, say. Personal hygiene in certain parts of the West is very questionable. Especially in the UK. The personal hygiene in the UK is very questionable. Not just among the whites, but among the citizens, the blacks too. It is very, very questionable. Not everybody, but it's questionable. I know one girl in the UK. That's one. She know the bat. Ukweli. <laughs> She know the, she she doesn't take a bath. Three days, four days. That one MK will not bath. She will go to work, come back with sweat, sleep like that. Maybe because the weather is cold, they know they sweat. So me, I don't know. Have you seen some of their teeth? The UK. They know we, we know they have bad dental hygiene there. Look at their teeth, you will know. Not all though. Because, I, like I said, I don't like to generalize. I know somebody that traveled to the UK. She was very shocked. She was like, they, they know they brush teeth for hair. She said, uh, many people know they brush teeth for hair. With that said, the part where I agree with her is that if Muzungu cry for your head, your own don't finish. <laughs> I agree with her 100% on that one. You see, a normal woman tears. If woman cry, come aside. My brother, nothing where you won't talk. People will believe the woman. That's how this world works. If a woman starts crying, once people see that the woman is crying, you as a man, nothing you won't talk. Nobody will believe you. Now the, now the cross will be carry as men. Now, imagine a Obroni woman, a Muzungu woman, a white woman crying. My brother, just go report yourself because you are finished. <laughs> you are finished. There is nothing you can say that will not put you in trouble. Once a white woman is crying, just go report yourself to police police because they go find charges where you know do put on top of your head. <laughs> and 
the same thing. I believe the same thing for uh, white men too. Because they will likely believe the white man over you. They will likely believe the white man because it's a, it's a stereotype. It's a, we live in a stereotyped world. They will likely believe the white man over you. That is just the way it is. That one, I agree. As for people not marrying the Oyibo you see versus the Oyibo you don't see, that one too, I will say I don't agree. Because I have a friend that married a white man. And that white man is the best thing that happened to that girl. Equally. That white man is the best thing to happen to that girl. He basically takes care of everything. In fact, if he can buy her oxygen, he will buy her oxygen. He's the best thing to happen to that girl. So, I don't agree with you saying, don't marry a white person. That one, I don't agree at all. I don't agree at all. They are really nice, really, really nice white people really really nice that are genuinely interested in the culture of africa because you know ba muzungu no get culture muzungu most of them no get culture so they like when they see people that have culture they are genuinely interested in knowing ah what is this what is this what is this and the truth is that why some are equinsu some are demons there are many that genuinely have a good heart and i'm sure among my followers, there are many people that married Muzungu and they are enjoying their marriage. So my sister, it's not good to generalize. I will not lie to you. It's not good. How will you feel if somebody come and say, uh, all black people no get sense? You know, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense now. It doesn't make sense at all. So please, people, if now white, if now Muzungu love carry you go and you see this person is a nice person. Put head. All we want is somebody that respects you, that treats you well, that understands you. The remaining thing is, is secondary. Hmm? So please, thank you. Hey, where are you going? In a smoky book. When you watch this video now, didn't you laugh? You laughed, but you still refuse to subscribe. Are you among my village people? <laughs> You are among my village people. You don't want me to make it in life. Continue. You refuse. You laughed. Shouldn't my reward be <laughs> click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, and click all notifications. And when you finish watching, you share. Share to your friends so that they too will laugh. So that me too, I will go far. But no, you decided to be among my village people. You want to watch and go. <laughs> don't be among my village people. They are not good people. I post videos every day, every single day, to make you laugh. If you join the tribe, the fantastic tribe, every day you will just be laughing. Look at this one now. This one is to watch all my funny videos playlist. This one is to watch my last video. And this one is to subscribe. 